happening tonight, friends and family. They're going to gather for a massive public memorial service to honor drag icon Hecalina in San Francisco. Hecalina passed away last month in London. Crown for us, Will Tran, live from the Castro Theater with the very latest. Good morning, Will. If it was just friends and family, the Castro Theater probably would be able to hold them. It's 1,400 seats inside, but it's not just that. It is fans. This place simply too small to hold all of the people, which is why you can see they just spray down the front here because they expect a large celebration to begin actually technically at around noon just a few hours from now and I can tell you it's expected to go all the way until midnight as you mentioned Hecklina a drag performer an icon in San Francisco unexpectedly died in London it was shocking reverberated not just in San Francisco but across the nation she was one of the pioneers as far as drag performers she died they were mulling on how to celebrate her life when they thought about the Castro Theater and then the outpouring just continued to come in and then they realized it simply is too small to hold all of the people. Take a look at your screen. This is what they are doing. They're actually going to spill out onto the streets. So they are prepared to start closing down this area in front of Castro starting at around noon, but technically the streets, 18th and Market. That will be shut down from noon all the way until midnight because so many people will be turning out to pay tributes. The Castro Theater still will be open to those who bought tickets. That will be available starting at 7 o'clock tonight. And then the celebrations will go all the way until 10 o'clock. And of course, it'll come out into the streets and then the celebration will continue. Muni, they have to make adjustments as well. So those buses will be going around this area, lines 24 and 35.